Hi, folks. Now, I know the Siberian Tiger origin story seemed like it left on a cliffhanger, but I actually have part two of it right here. And I also have the arrest footage of him inside of his home being detained and dragged out. But before we get started, as always, a big thank you to all my new and current channel members and subscribers. Without your guys' continuous ongoing support, I couldn't keep the channel going. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Also, if you could for me, please subscribe to the page, leave a like and a comment, and please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, let's enjoy today. Hey, back behind cover. Push over on that side. Yeah. You have eyes on him still? Pull your shield out. Freudenberg, where are you at? I'm gonna go over there. Okay, who do we have here? Over hands. What we're seeing here is the body cam footage of the SWAT team coming up with a plan to flank the house and to rescue the hostages, in this case, his family, from his own stupidity. We're going to watch this for a little bit, and then we're going to jump to getting the rest of the story from the tow truck drivers, and then going into his wife's arrest, and then his. Go to my house. Taser. You have 40. been warned. Cover wall. Okay. Well, it's Christian. All right. Now, put your hands up. Cross the line. Got thing in your hands. You better get your sheriff out of Hands up. You crossed the line. You should. Call your weapons on my young children. Who's that over there? Freud. You Fre run your weapons on young okay. children. Freud and Holsey, you stay I there. Not call you. Yeah. We're going to take a couple more yep. over on this side. Yep. And we're going to L off on him yep. and try to perform the rescue on them. Okay. Uh, who do I have here? Christian. Christian? Yeah. Who do I have here? Langlois. Christian and Langlois. So you're going to come with Fisk and Shin. Luke, you're coming with me. We're going to go plus up on Nielsen. To the right? To the right of my patrol car. Nielsen, I'm sending some to flush you up. Go inside your home, we want your hostages! Don't tell me what to do, I'm on my own property, I have Go inside your home! Kiss my ass! We want your hostages, you have hostages, go inside your home, do it now! Nielsen, you run that team and see if we can't get to the hostages in that truck. If you fail to comply, force will be used against you. Go inside your homes Try right it. now. Try it. Mm -hmm. I'm your huckleberry. That's just my game. Try it. Okay, Lyle, plus up with Holsey over there. Right, I'm up and over. His name is in the orange. He's the one that... Nielsen, can you uh, confirm there's people in that truck? You're holding them against your will. Go inside your home. That's my wife that has been held. You're holding them against your will. Go inside your home. Okay, I want to area deny him. So we want to push up. Nielsen, we're pushing up. We're pushing up. Go inside your home. Do it now. Go in your home. Go in your home. We're here for the hostages. At this point, the hostages have been removed from the truck. Now we're going to jump ahead to see their side of the story and what happens with them talking to the sheriff's deputies and other members of SWAT team. Kiss my ass. But if he moves towards the truck, of course, will be used against him. 
And at this point, we have uh, okay. obstructing. Drop it. Start to be all the way there. in the air, secured. Then Warm this three or four out. times, get off the property. Sit down on us. We got to get out of this property. It's private property. Well, then she come out. Mm -hmm. She and then I was uh, yeah. you can go plus up that team that's in front of the tow truck there. Nielsen Morgan's coming to you, and I'm working on that now. And then he started hitting the window on the driver's side. Uh, you don't Your get window? Out of here and yeah, uh, the driver's side. He was in the driver's seat. Gotcha. Um, okay. And, what did, and then told us deal? if we got out of the truck that he'd consider us a threat and he would defend himself. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> she told us to open the windows and walk the door. So, so a weird question. When he stated those like things, how did You said you were in fear for your life? Oh, yeah. And for him to be doing that in front of his children? I have kids. Mm -hmm. Okay, what do we have? Uh, so, so okay. you want to be a victim of a crime? Yeah. Okay. okay. PC felony harassment on recording that right and then can we confirm that wife is in the jeep still he said has she gotten out of the vehicle she got in like i said after she's still in she's still in the vehicle and wife is still in the vehicle the jeep in the front and we have we have dash cam do we have felony harassment I mean, on all three or just the guy in the orange? So I wasn't okay. in the uh, at this point, uh, guy in the orange for sure. We're working on the other two. He's just listening now. His dad's yeah, just the dad making all Yeah, I'm coming across. Now we've seen a lot of this and heard a lot of this dialogue from the first video. So we're now going to start jumping ahead to when they start to try to get the wife out of the car and arrest her. Take the shield. That's okay. All right, Morgan, you're going to be the primary. Frydenberg, you'll be less than the back. Yeah, she's on the driver's seat. She's locked in. Exit out. Come out of the car. Bobby. <laughs> huh? What? Nah. Yeah, I'm getting ready to. Oh, that's right, folks. You heard them. They're going to smash those windows because she's failing to remove herself from the vehicle upon receiving a lawful order from law enforcement to do so. That would count as obstruction, which is a misdemeanor charge in Washington State where this is taking place. Get out of the car. Ma'am, that's a lawful order. If you don't do so, we're going to smash your window. We're going to smash your window if you don't come out. Huh? Open the door. Exit the vehicle. Is she under arrest? At this point, obstruction. Hey, you're obstructing with a law enforcement investigation. You need to exit out of the car. 
I'm going to break this window. Do you understand that? You're under arrest for obstruction. Exiting the car. <coughs> Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. And now we're going to call shenanigans on the wife here because she is refusing to get out of the car, which is obstruction. And well, if you're on the phone with your lawyer trying to get advice on the situation, I'm fairly certain your lawyer would advise you to stop breaking the law and cooperate with law enforcement. Because at this point, you're only making yourself look a hell of a lot worse and getting your ass in a lot more trouble. Okay. Watch those top windows. You got a window break? Check that door. All the doors are locked. All right. We're going to pop this window. Make sure there's no kids or anything in the back seat. And then we'll unlock the door. This is your last chance. Exit the car. You're under arrest for obstruction. Perfect. Watch your eyes. Watch this. Ready? Oh man, let's try a different point. Around the edge. Oh. Get it? Damn! Exit the vehicle! Yeah, reach through. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna be able to get this. I can't reach the, the lock. I don't wanna break the window with her there then. Yeah. Exit the car! Hey, give me a second. No, exit the car now! Yeah, you got three seconds to exit that car, you're getting peppered. One, two, three. Get out! Get out of the car! Yes, you are. Drop what's in your hand. Drop the keys now. You're gonna get pepper now. Seven, five, six females out of the car being detained. Do you Do that. You're under arrest, ma'am. Haven't done anything wrong in my career. No, you did do something wrong. You did break the law. Obstruction for one, because you did not cooperate with a lawful order from law enforcement and hindered them from executing their duties. Secondly, you could be akin to unlawful imprisonment, as I went over in the first video, since you are knowingly preventing these two men from leaving. That is also a felony in the state of Washington. What's up? I got taser if we need it. I'll have to make a phone call. Chris, we're going to come on here. Hey, I'm gonna pull if you're cool with it. Hey, Fern. Okay, let's. He's under arrest. Back in. <coughs> Alright. You good? Yeah. Go back to your uh, your spot over there, behind cover. Are you with them? I'm with them. Okay, go ahead. Now we saw the wife's arrest. Let's see this idiot get his comeuppance. I know I've promised you guys that in the first video, but I couldn't get it in there because I thought it was in that part, but I have the footage. So, let's enjoy. By the way, they broke the window unlawfully. You're lying! I'm on my knees. Okay, I'm not a threat. Your family's a threat. So you can come back to us. My family's upstairs and they're not a threat. If they are watching, they are a threat. If they are recording, which then is their right. We are within our own house. You That's have right. unlawfully entered this house. And we are not a threat. And you did not present the warrant before you broke through my house. I see you're still taking the advice of little DeCastro over there. Let me give you guys a little bit of a pointer here. They don't need a warrant to enter your house at this point because 
not only do they have reasonable articulable suspicion, but exigent circumstances take effect here because you are in the commission of a crime and they know you're in there because of the hostage situation that you have caused, they can actually enter your house, detain you. And you did not announce yourself that you are police. You did not announce. The cats might be get up much as downstairs. You just broke okay, through, through my window. Guys, They're not gonna run. Whoa, hey, come on. You wanna blind us? Come on. Really? Dude, really? Just take a freaking power trip. And we're gonna end it here. The finale to the origin stories of Siberian Tiger, one of the worst First Amendment frauditors we have ever seen. Not only has he got his family involved in this shenanigans here, but he's risked their lives and possibly could have gotten them hurt or all arrested. If you guys like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave a thumbs up and a comment because it helps me with the algorithm. And if you can, please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, and a special thank you to all members of the news team. Without your continuous ongoing support, I couldn't keep the channel going, so thank you from the bottom of my heart.